Uh, hey, what's going on, guys? My name is Grun, and today is going to be our episode number two. Show you guys how to base my premium made data matter. To like, literally, guys, you don't even have to download any other two guys. Everything in here is basically integrated on my Discord, so you don't have to be downloading programs or anything like that. You know what I'm saying? In here, guys, it's literally integrated. Like, all you need is basically join my Discord and have basically access to the AI YMAP tool or the auto merger deck. Like, this is the only tools that you're basically going to need in order to fix your MLOs or identify what's causing the issues. So we're going to be uh, testing this out and show you guys right now how this really works. So first thing first, all you got to do is pretty much join my Discord server. I'll be providing a link on the comment section below and also on this video description. I'll be providing the link so you guys be able to click on and join. After you join, you just got to make sure you verify that you're not a robot. Okay, after you verify, it gives you a role like everybody else. You can see here, you know, you mean you're basically verified and stuff like that. So you're basically good to go. So after that, uh, there's two options. You can use the AI YMAP or you want to use the auto merger this is all basically all exclusive tool that basically needs to pretty much uh, fix some stuff you know what I'm saying so anyways so you'll be able to use the AI map tool on the auto merger so in this video we're gonna be using this and I'm gonna show you guys how to basically identify the issue and fix the issue so guys watching this video make sure you guys leave a like if you're new on my channel hit that subscribe button show some support guys you know what I'm saying but anyways we're gonna click on this one it's gonna create you a private link and this is a premium tool you definitely got to pay in order to use this tool and uh, once you bear, once you make the payment since I already have the role it turns it gives you a auto merger role and you pretty much be able to access to this tool so all, all I have to do is pretty much do the slash auto merger but one if you per, if you want to purchase this just click on the link and make sure you buy it and then uh, just follow the instructions what it says there and after that you send the payment it will process automatically and it will automatically give you a roll so right now we're going to use uh, the auto uh, the auto merger uh, command and it's just going to create a uh, a ticket for us and we'll be able to use it for one hour so it's a pretty cool uh, tool that I have and what I like about this is I updated and make it look way better more nice so yeah so anyways so all you gotta do is click on this little box and then you just gotta make sure you click on the MLO that contains all the MLOs you know what I'm saying so here's a YouTube video for example this is my maps folder right and I have um, you know the some MLOs you know what I'm saying let's say I just got the police station I do have the CFX and team uh, legion which is the legion and I do have the map data manager so make sure you always click on the root of the folder that contains all my low so you just click it and select okay and view files so i can tell that right now that 3d market police has led issues so it's conflicting the one from legion so we're going to remove anything that is related to 3d market mlo so for example let's say you have another mlo on your end uh make sure you only delete the same folder that it's causing the conflict so for example you click this and click any, anything that's related to the MLO that you're having issues, you know what I'm saying? So like, uh, you know, I'm having issues with the 3D market because the props. So you delete whatever MLO it has on your on your end and make sure you just delete it, okay? Then you click delete, make sure it's ready. Make sure like, for example, if you do it like that, no, make sure you select the only MLO that's causing issues, okay? And then you just gotta, it's just a lot of Y maps here causing conflicts, right? So all you gotta do is just delete it, select them all. After that, you delete and process, okay? And then you save. And then you could select a folder, but I recommend not to because you need to have a little bit more experience to use this. So just cancel this and I'm gonna make sure you guys have something cool that you'd be able to pretty much do. So it gives you the activities and logs exactly what you've been doing. You know, you remove some few MLOs, right? So this will fail because you didn't want to create a map data, but that's actually some next level stuff, which I'm going to be making a video later on. So make sure let's hit at least 30 likes. But anyways, we're going to open up Co-Walker, all right? This is the most easiest part in the world, guys. You know what I'm saying? Once your Co-Walker loads up, you click enable DLC. It's going to take some time. So while that loads up, I'm going to be advertising my services. So if you guys want me to fix your MLOs, guys, um, 
you know, I basically offer a full merging services, meaning I can make all your MLOs compatible, even though they're escrow or anything like that, everything is possible. I have a lot of experience. I've worked on pretty much every goddamn MLO that has been created on 5M, you know what I mean? So I'm fully highly trusted. You guys go check out my, uh, my Discord right now. Uh, I do have awesome reviews to people that I worked on. You can check it out, guys. Literally five stars. You know, everything here is about quality. Make sure everything gets done right. So, yeah, anyways, you just got to join my Discord, guys. And I'll be providing a link in the comment section below and stuff like that. So, uh, yeah, anyways, let's go back into our uh, little manager, okay? And then uh, we're going to open up CoWalker, right? You press T, click the down arrow, open folder. And then from there, you're gonna go to your resources folder that contains the MLOs, which it is in this video, we're gonna be putting this one. And then you click yes. It takes a little time to load up, you know what I'm saying? It takes a little minute. If this shows up, it's fine. Nothing's gonna happen. They're just locked. They, you know, people you won't be able to steal their work. So it's all good, no worries. So this is an MRP. So I was having issues with the props because usually it was stuff like from MRPD and Legion, there's issues going on. So you know what I'm saying? So there's no literally, you see, this is a big ass park. So what we did is pretty much delete everything that is conflicting on this area to make this one compatible with this one. So on the park right here. So we're going to go back to the MRPD. So this is pretty cool. So I'm going to show you guys how to fix the LED issue, which is the little distance like that. You know, I'm going to show you how to do that. So first and first, you got to make sure you click on collusions and you can see right now that these props are not part of the MLO. The ones that are like sitting down looking professional like those, that is actually part of the MLO. So you just got to make sure you remove pretty much the prop that is causing the issue. So in here, we see one, two, three, four, and five props are floating. Okay, so we're gonna go back to entity and then we're gonna delete uh, we're gonna delete this one, delete this one, we're gonna basically select it, delete that one over there, and I believe let me just make sure I like to double check this one is still floating, so we're definitely gonna select that. So that's one, two, three, four, five, and then click this little up down move arrow, bring it down, just bring that down, okay, and then now we're gonna fix the LED issues, you know, like the render distance and stuff like that. So you're gonna click on LED. So you see max LED. So we're using the Orfano HD. So we're gonna go to LED lights, okay? And from here, you could bring things down. You know what I'm saying? Just break it down. Bam. You select it, bring it down. You select it, you bring it down. Okay, just like that. Don't be scared. Just click on it. And break it down okay and now this one the final one you bring it down just like that oh shit i forgot i selected so it doesn't does that now i gotta load up it's gonna load up the y map so just give it a sec just give it a sec okay okay and now you bring it down and now you will see some random stuff so you just gotta select them okay and that one over here, you bring it down. Just like that. And now we're gonna go back to our final and then and that's and then you can see the render distance. It's not causing it now. So you go like all over here, it's not gonna show up like the default. Once you get close to it, it disappeared. So it's a good thing. Now we're gonna see if there's any uh, issues with flickering issues. So we're gonna go occlusions. So everything looks good. There's nothing overlapping or touching in here, so that's fine. So we pretty much just fix this whole MLO in less than a couple minutes or so. That's why I recommend using my map data manager, guys. Literally, you'd be able to purchase this. It makes your life easier, just easy. So you also see here, this one is kind of like, just make sure like sometimes there's some MLOs that see this. You select this one, just bring it down. Okay, so now let's go to collusion. See, everything looks perfectly. It's supposed to be like this. There shouldn't be no props or anything like that. Okay? So this is how the MLO, you know, that's how you basically fix the MLO. So now, what we're going to do is we're going to open up the, the all the files it contains. And then you got to make sure you select stuff that has a little star. So I'm going to show you guys a little example here. 
so this is one of them you select so this is for the LED issue so we're gonna put it inside into a stream folder so let's say we put this one inside the police station NRPD and we're gonna go into Y maps no that's the wrong one exteriors and then you put them in here and then you use BAM you save it like that okay and then uh, once it's done that all you got to do is pretty much click on render GTA 5 and then click on the bottom one first and the top one so everything looks up fine just like that and then all we got to do is pretty much look for one more for one little more this was already done so sometimes that should show up you know because it's just co-walker so all you got to do is just save all I recommend doing this one or twice you know what I'm saying just to confirm that everything that we modify it actually saves anyways and that's how you basically fix props so if everything looks right guys you pretty much did a pretty good job you know what I'm saying that's how you're supposed to look like so shouldn't be no props there shouldn't be no flickering issues issues have been solved so if you guys want to use my tool make sure you guys go to group group 5m uh, make sure you go to my discord make sure you click the verification that you're not a robot and from there you'll be able to access to my uh, auto y map tool so you guys watching this video make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe and thanks for watching